what, what the lady's is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Notorious drug cartel boss El Chapo has promised to not have any jurors murdered during his upcoming New York trial, according to his lawyer. El Chapo made the promise in a motion that was recently filed by his defense attorney to counter the prosecutor's demands of keeping the jury at his trial anonymous and under protection. His lawyer said it would create the extremely unfair impression that he is a dangerous person from whom the jury must be protected. Prosecutors have requested Brooklyn Federal Court Judge Brian Cogan to impanel an anonymous and partially sequestered jury. They also asked for the jury to be protected by armed guards in a motion filed earlier this month, citing El Chapo's history of violence and instances where he tried to silence witnesses in the past as the reason for these extreme measures. <laughs> you know when somebody say, hey man, I ain't gonna have no jurors murdered. That's like saying, hey man, I'm gonna have the jurors murdered. <laughs> this dude, this dude got to be gangster, huh? I've never heard anything like that in my life. Dude got to be dangerous, huh? They got to get him to promise. He got to promise. Hey, man. Okay, I promise. I won't have anybody killed. <laughs> El Chapo is a gangster for real. I thought he was going to catch up with Trump for us, man. But I think Trump a little bit out of reach for him right now. I think he's just trying to get, he's trying to free up. But you know what? They're saying that El Chapo is dangerous because it doesn't matter if he's locked up or not. The man got resources and he's able to get things to go his way whether he's locked up or not. It's going to be interesting. Say he promised to not kill anybody. How would you like to be on that jury? <laughs> Can you imagine how many people are coming up with all kinds of excuses? How many... I bet you they went through over a thousand jurors trying to pick that 12. Basically, the prosecutors are saying in his efforts to subvert justice, El Chapo has killed some people. So we're afraid for our jurors. We need them sequestered. We need them protected. We don't want El Chapo to kill the jurors. <laughs> See, that's the thing about American justice. You jump on that stand and you testify, man, you on your own. You can't rely on them. Man, you know how many witnesses has been killed throughout the years? And El Chapo, I know some of y'all saying, man, he's dangerous. We got to get him off the street. We got to give him 100 years. We got to get rid of him. Man, he ain't no different from a regular politician. The main difference is the uniform he wears, just like police officers. Man, you got police officers out here who are out of their damn minds. Ain't got no business walking around with a gun and a badge. But they're doing it, and they're killing machines. Some of them kill so much they, get, they bounce around from department to department. They get fired from one day and they get hired at another one. This happens all the time. Or they do something inappropriate or kill somebody, kill an innocent person, and they get moved to a different department or they, they resign and then another department hires them. Who's not gonna hire a cop that's, ki that's killed? That's what they do, they kill. Who's not gonna hire a killer cop? If you got you run in a police department, that's what y'all do anyway. Y'all kill people, kill innocent people all the time. So why wouldn't you hire a cop with a record for killing? They say El Chapo is a man of his word. I don't know the dude, but 
but I'll go ahead and give them the benefit of doubt for sake of argument. El Chapo ain't going to kill the jurors. Okay, so I believe that. But only if he pinky swear. You know, once you pinky swear, man, you pinky swear, man. You, you got to hold the end of the bargain, man. You got to, you know, like you cannot abuse the pinky swear. That's the real deal. So if he pinky swear, I believe him. Only problem that I can foresee is that he never said he wouldn't kill the prosecutor and the judge. No more talk. Yeah.